AC Infinity just launched a brand new series of grow lights called the Ion Frame. They sent me the Ion Frame Evo 3 LED grow light, which is great for a 2 foot by 4 foot coverage area. But they also have grow lights for other size coverage areas, such as the Evo 4 for a 3 by 3, Evo 6 for a 4 by 4, and the Evo 8 for a 5 by 5. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. For those of you that don't know me, my name is Chris aka Mr. Grow It, and today I have a product highlight video for you. This is a brand new series where we highlight some of the best gardening products on the market today. In this video, I'll talk a little bit about the Ion Frame LED Grow Light while I unbox the unit, so you can learn more about it and see what comes in the box. I do have a discount code for this grow light, code Mr. Grow It 15. That actually works for all AC Infinity Grow Lights and all of their products in their hydroponics and growers category, as well as their grow accessories category. Upon opening the box, I noticed that they put some information on the inside flap. First thing out the box is the driver. This driver can be mounted on the fixture or can be kept off the fixture and kept outside of your grow space, for example. Pulling out the grow light from the box and then opening up this smaller box. Inside this box is a UIS M2M 10 foot cord, UIS M2M 2 foot cord, stainless steel wire hangers, a wire tie set, hook and loop ties, various screws for mounting, and some rope ratchet hangers. Here is the driver extension cord. These are the driver brackets in case you want to mount the driver to the fixture. Here is the schedule controller where you can set daily light schedules and even simulate sunrise and sunset. And lastly, they include a user manual and an intro to growing book. The first thing I notice when handling the light is that it is extremely light. The frame is actually magnetic, so you can pair the ion frame with the ion beam light bars if you choose to provide supplemental full spectrum or uv light the unit pulls 280 watts from the wall at 100 percent the diodes on this fixture are samsung lm 301h evo diodes this is samsung's latest diode and is top of the line in horticultural lighting these diodes are very efficient and algorithmically placed on a bar style fixture to admit a uniform full spectrum of light efficiency comes in at 3.14 micromoles per joule Wow. In the user manual, they show you how to hang the fixture, although I personally like to do it a little bit differently. I use two light ratchet hangers only. Simply loop each light ratchet hanger over the top of the grow tent bar, then connect each end to the grow light, as I'm doing here. This makes it so much easier to move the light up and down by simply holding onto one side of the fixture while pulling the rope. It is part of the UIS platform, so you can connect it to a Controller 69 or Controller 69 Pro. I'm using the UIS M2M cord, which is 10 feet long, to connect from the driver to my Controller 69 Pro. I then go to the AC Infinity app, tap on the controller in my 2x4 for port 2, which is the port that the light is connected to. I'm changing it from off to schedule. I'm then setting the start time for when the light should turn on, then setting the stop time for when the light should turn off. Easy. Also, to set the dimmer percent, I'm going from schedule to on. The setting of six shown here is 60%. I'm gonna change it to five for now, which is 50%. Lastly, I'm going back to schedule so that the light will turn on and off according to what I've set. AC Infinity recommends hanging this grow light at least one foot above your plants and to set your percentage to 40% for the seedling stage, 80% for the vegetative stage, and 100% for the flowering stage. The height will vary based on the plant you're growing. They show the coverage area for all of the LED grow lights in their Evo series in their user manual. Like I mentioned earlier, I have the Evo 3, which has a flowering coverage area of two feet by four feet, but they have other grow lights for larger spaces, such as three by three, four by four, and five by five. There is more to this grow light, so for more information, click the link down in the description section below. I'll place the link in a pinned comment as well. What do you think about this grow light? Let me know down in the comment section below. I hope you enjoyed this product highlight video. If you have any suggestions for other products that I should highlight in a future video, let me know. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video.